Hi, um, I'm going to show you now how to tell students uh, to see a recording and I'm going into one of my current courses just so that um, you can see a real, um, you, you need to wait for at least an hour for a recording to be posted on the Blackboard, under Blackboard Collaborate. So you tell students to go to your initial tab. I um, title my task, click here for our online sessions through Blackboard Collaborate rather than just Blackboard Collaborate. So you uh, tell them to click on that. Once they are in Blackboard Collaborate, you can tell them to click on the menu and then click on recordings. And you can see here that I have different recordings of the sessions that I have done. They are selected, they are um, ordered by date. Um, you can do this, you can click here, copy a, the link to that recording and send it to the students via email. So once they click in that, on that link, they are just directly here. One thing that uh, is cool that I have found out is that if you go into the course room and you, obviously I locked it. Um, if you go into the course room and you join course room and you can do your own uh, sessions um, whenever you want them. And once you stop recording, the sessions will be recorded and they will be posted on the recordings as well. And if you go here, you can edit the name of that particular session. So uh, you can see that I've edited, in this case, I've added information about essay 2. So uh, this will help students, you know, once they see this, uh, they can find out, uh, you know, they can choose the sessions that they want to listen to several times. And it's not very... Um, confusing because if you just let them as I have them here for example by date and time or recording one recording two uh, they may not know what happened during that recording so that that's something useful for them all right I hope this has been helpful